Hi there. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to submit your ePortfolio page to your personal tutor. So the first thing we need to do is find your personal tutor submission page. So if we scroll down the front page of Moodle once you've logged on to nursing, click on the nursing icon, and then this will bring up all the nursing courses. Within subcategories, we can find the ePortfolio submissions pages here. And these, within this page, all the personal tutors within the BSc nursing course will have their own individual page. For this example, I'm going to the page uh, that I've made for this tutorial, the personal tutor example page. But obviously for your submission, you need to find the tutor of which you need to submit to. So click on the page and this will either let you straight into the course or it may be that you need an enrollment key of which you should obtain this from the person, your own personal tutor. Once you're within the page, you then need to scroll down the page to find the places where you can submit the page. So here we can see um, there's three submissions that you'll be undertaking within year one. There's two within year two and two within year three. So it's obviously very important that you choose the correct area of which you're going to submit the page. So as this will be your first page, more than likely, you need to, in this case, click on page one, year one, introduction. What this will then do is bring up a window where Moodle is looking into your ePortfolio page, into your Mahara ePortfolio, and it will see all the pages that you have there. Now, obviously, if it's the first time you've ever created a page in Mahara, it's more than likely you only have one page. But as the course progresses and you develop your skills and knowledge and experience, you may be developing far more pages, and this is where you'll see a number of pages in the future. So here it's very important that you uh, choose the right page to submit because once the page is submitted you cannot unsubmit it without getting feedback from your tutor. So make sure you choose the correct page and good practice is to have a look at the page. You can click on it, it will open a new window and that will show you the page just before you submit. If you're happy to submit the page click submit and that will load the page into uh, the submission area and you can hear, see here it says submitted page introduction page and that's it your page has now been sent to your tutor and they can review it leave you feedback and once this feedback has been left for the page it will unlock it you can edit it again within Mahara and act on any feedback that your tutor has given to you. In order to return back to the course you can click the link here or it may be you want to come back to the front page of Moodle once you've submitted your page.